360 take three marker. Tracy, there's a blizzard coming. I'll be closing my office after my next appointment. Oh, my brother's been gone for two days. I saw it in the newspaper. I'm very sorry. I really gotta find my brother. I'm sure that your parents and the police are doing everything that they can. No, they're not. Let's schedule an appointment immediately after the blizzard. Oh, no, I, I can't wait till after the blizzard. I need you to help me now. I can't help you find your brother, Tracy. That's not my job. Why don't you go home? This is an important time for family. You need to love how to support one another. Do you live in a condominium? Oh, I live in my house. Well, how many people live in your house? You know, because I was okay. thinking, maybe I could rent a room. And then when they find Sunny, Sunny and I could come and live with you. Tracy, I have a client coming. Yeah, maybe you'd like the company. That's something we could discuss at our appointment. When is our next appointment? Um, just think about it for a second, you know? You'd come home from work and there'd be somebody there. Oh, and Sonny, he'd come on. He's no problem at all. I mean, he doesn't even, he doesn't even, um, he doesn't even talk. Tracy, so. you can't come home with me. Why not? Well, for one thing, there are rules. I'm not, I'm not gonna go telling anybody. Why don't you go home? Because I'm insane. And you know what that means. Not exactly. It surprises me a little. It means I should be locked up. Go home, Tracy. I can't go home if I'm insane. Talk to your parents. Contrary to what you may assume, your feelings would comfort them now. They need to know how this is affecting you. Fuck that. What was that? Nothing. I'm just really worried that I'm going insane. Well, if you're worried, go to the hospital. Where they put the nut bars? If you will. Well, will, will you come visit me? Of course. Am I going to be locked up forever? Like, like jail or something? They'll probably evaluate you and then release you the same day. Why don't you talk to my service? We can schedule an emergency appointment on Monday. Are they going to use shock therapy? You know, electricity up and down my body like Frankenstein? I read about it in a magazine. What magazine? It doesn't matter. The point is, is that they do it, and you can't let them because I can't forget. I can't forget anything. Forget what? You know. You know because you can see inside my brain. That is why they pay you the big bucks. Please. Tracy. Sometimes we think too much. Sometimes it's best to stop thinking too much. It's our own enemy. Go home. Watch TV, be with your family, and wait for news to come in. I'm certain it will be good news. Tracy, I want you to understand that ultimately your recovery is your responsibility. I could leave tomorrow and a new therapist could take my place. What other therapist? There is no other therapist. I'm simply saying that your recovery is ultimately your responsibility. Are you going to stop seeing me? I never said that. Yes, you did. You just said something about another therapist. Well, you know what? I'll leave first. You'll see. Well, if that's the case, we can arrange another appointment. Would you care to book another appointment? I've got an appointment. I'm sorry, I've let this go on far longer than is appropriate. I'm sorry that I can't see you, but I have a client waiting outside. Of course you have another fucking client. What was that? Nothing. Nothing, I was... 
Just kidding, you know, just joking. It's okay to express your anger. What do you know about anger, you cunt? You fucking stupid robot cunt! Oh my god, I'm so sorry. No, I'm really, 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 really sorry. Look, I just, I can't leave until I know right now that you're not gonna send me to somebody else. That was never my intention. You're a liar. You are a liar, and why would I want to see a psychiatrist who's a liar anyway? <clears throat> Ooh.